Okay, so guys, this is the same game, but I'm now first going to tell you the health boosters programming and then how I made those sprites. And so for health booster, when I receive game over hide, that's the first one. Mm, and then there's one flat quit. Okay, motion. So what I'm going to do is put it on a random position. And then duplicate this for Y. Hide. So I'm going to use the pick random one again because well, this is going to be a random booster, so we will go to control, and it has to appear at a random time. So wait one second. No, no, wait one second. Pick random. Five to ten seconds. So that's it, and then it will show. And then forever. If touching player, then change player all by two. This is going to be one good poster. Okay, so one thing I forgot is when I receive game over. Okay, so in this draw, hide variable, player held, and in the start, show variable. No, no, no. no. Player held, same for the enemy. Ball um, enemy health yeah so that's it and go to health booster change player held by two looks hide okay so so i'm going to duplicate this and it, it will go to another position a random position again So yeah, it's going to do this again, and another if then, is then not touching the edge thing again. You can skip this step because the health booster can appear anywhere so you can show where the health booster is. It's up completely up to you. Okay. Again, I forget. It has to be F then else. Else. Hide and. Yes, that's the whole booster done. So, for the player, how I made it. Okay, so the idol costume is just one big circle with this fill and this outline with the size of four. These two are also circles with uh, this circle with the different in size. 
this is just these rectangles like the square you two you can use and these extended these and to make it look like a punch and in the first costume you can just add a, a rectangle another rectangle and three blue circles and this actually we don't need this so yeah we don't even use il2 i just made it for fun and for map we just go make this thing which is basically nothing and you just set the size to 500 to make this one. okay so this is like one big green square and this is just a circle and you can use the reshape tool like to like change its appearance and do the same with these one and then add a grid to it with the line tool again when i already told you how to make this one and the box is just a line with two so with, it's just a box with silver lines in it to make it look cool <laughs> so this is just a uh, um a line yeah it's just a line with an outline of 10. Enemy bullet is just a duplicate of this. Enemy enemy is just a duplicate of fair with but with different colors. Hell booster is just a square rectangles and these are also squares. So as for the backdrops This is just with nothing we don't want any backdrop in the start since we have the map. This is a U win screen. This is a U screen. You can just uh, show the text tool U and then press enter and then write win and then increase the size. And this is the thumbnail. No, I'm sorry. Did the thumbnail appear in the start? Come on, why are, why are these still showing? Okay, okay. The variables. Just go and hide this variable. Player house. Where is player house? Yeah, and in the enemy. In this chart. No way. Here. Let's go and hide this. Enemy health. Now it's your word. Let me see the project page. Um, what about drops? I forgot to hide the map, I think. Looks. Hide. Now let me try. Give it a word. Yeah. So, we're just chilling out where the enemy is going. Just joking, I'm. So, yeah. This is the game. Thank you. And I'll post a link in the description.